explain how this day come to be. A few weeks ago in a local footy match, we camped down playing terrain. We're up top, some of us were having a few refreshments. And it came up a conversation about the ridge not being able to drive around the lake. Phil said, why not? He said, uh, it's political, something to do with insurance. I wasn't all over it. But he said, uh, well, we need to look at that. And I said, Phil, people have already tried. They had a visit, they come to nothing. He said, perhaps they didn't try hard enough. <laughs> that was his attitude, and this is what it's come to today. Now, Phil, for those of you who don't know him, he's the one there with the sun shining off his dome, <laughs> just there in the blue shirt. Brought up here, went to school here, played footy here. He was a member of the under-18, 1979 Premiership team. <laughs> what a great side that was. <laughs> but thanks very much, Phil. Your efforts are uh, just tremendous. It surprised me. I was a doubter. Now, what I want you to do is come to the right-hand side, but just just before we do that, after uh, I bring up our local Robbie Burns, Mr. Michael Prebner, Lick for short. He's going to come up and uh, show you what he thinks about the whole situation. If you know of any Lick's previous works, you would have seen his article in the local paper about the, the arboretum at the caravan park. So he's very good. And listen, listen very closely because uh, I'll have a lot of points about today.